A law is essentially the most formal expression of the will of the state. It's written and it's passed um, by the federal parliament. A bill is a proposed legislative text that is introduced in the House of Commons or the Senate to be studied by both houses and perhaps eventually passed. Once it is passed by both houses and signed by uh, the Governor General, it becomes a statute. Welcome to this lesson in which we will explore some of the key concepts that underlie the process of drafting legislation and regulations in Canada. Another major step in, in legislative drafting practice took place after the Second World War uh, in the late 40s with a series of cabinet directives which um, established the legislation section of the Department of Justice as the authority, the body, to draft all government bills. Once the drafting instructions and the MC as a whole has been approved by Cabinet, it comes to us, we take the drafting instructions, and we, uh, the Legislative Council, turn the non-technical uh, instructions into legislative language. Bidral experts in the legislative process intervene at different stages. So I've described the, the work environment of Legislative Council um, in both sections, legislation and regulation, is a really collaborative environment. It, it's teamwork. Um, because at the federal level, legislation and you know, regulations are drafted in both English and French, so on each file you'll always have an English drafter and you'll have a French drafter. With our guests, we will review these important principles that underline the democratic process of making regulations and laws in Canada.